Hello and welcome to Dust Star Studios. This is, I think, like my maybe 14th try filming this in the past few days. So, um, this is my second video, I think, on my channel. I already posted a Christmas special as my first video, and I'm just making this video to tell you a bit about me. So, on this channel, my name will be Star. It says that all in the about section of my channel. You can go to it and check that out. So over there, it also talks a little, not talks, says a little bit about me. But I'm going to tell you even more about me. I'm Star, and that's what I'm going to be calling myself on this channel. And I really like dolls, 18 inch dolls specifically. Not just American Girl dolls. I also have a My Life As doll here, and I have an Our Generation doll, but I also really love American Girl dolls. This here is Blair Wilson, and in my about, I also have a list of all my dolls and their brand. So, after this video, check it out. And she's probably the most like me. She loves nature, crafting, and just some sports too. But for the sportiness, it'd probably be Doss because I don't surf, but I do do cheerleading. I really like dolls. I love everything colorful. I have a lot of colorful stuff. Favorite time period or decade is the 80s. I love scrunchies, colorfulness, neon, Curly hair, I want curly hair, but my hair is pretty straight. It's kind of wavy, but not even that much. It's kind of tangled, it looks weird on the camera. Um, I just love all that, and the cheerfulness of the 80s. Also, I love tie-dye overalls, I like jeans and that, so. <laughs> Courtney is a doll that describes me a lot, and yeah. So, I have six dolls, I'll name them in the order I got them. Rose, Kayla, Jessica, or Jess, Jenny, Blair, and Josh. And I hope to get maybe two more dolls in the future. One or two more dolls in the future. I don't want that much and I want their family to be like a kind of normal size. And they live in a dollhouse, which I have a dollhouse in my bedroom, which is really big. It's so tall, it's almost up to the ceiling of my bedroom and that's really tall. And I'm tall for a 10 year old and I'm 10. While I'm filming this video and I cannot reach the top I can hardly reach the kitchen I can reach it enough to play with but not that much to like take out mini stuff until like, I clean it I can reach it too but I would like to have it a bit lower but I can't because of the size of how many rooms I have I have four bedrooms bedrooms in my dollhouse um, a storage room office two closets, bathroom, a kitchen, a living room that's not really in my dollhouse, but it's like part of my dollhouse, kinda. I don't know, I'll explain that in another video, which will be my dollhouse tour. I'll do that when I have 20 plus subscribers. Um, and then I have just a room in my dollhouse in which I keep things like the job stuff, like the hair salon stuff. I have a Walmart set, it's like a shopping cart, and like a vet clinic set. So I keep all of that up there and all my pets because I have a lot of doll pets and I mean a lot. And that's a, so a bit about me. I used to have chickens as my pet so I also relate that to Blair because she lived in a farm. I got her when I was eight years old, almost nine, because I, with my friend, always wanted to be a farmer and a baker since I was like three years old or four years old. And I said I'd do most of the farming and she'd do most of the baking, but we'd do a bit of each because we both like animals and baking and we're both really good at it. So um, I do want to change my job a bit, but Blair also wanted to like become an interior designer in her second book not really become but she really liked it and she met a person from an interior design show that she liked so I also want to become an interior designer or a set designer because of my love for dolls I, I designed my whole dollhouse and I like it for a 10 year old I also designed like sets for my doll stop motions like school sets and like store sets all of those I made and I kind of change the room sometimes for stop motion. And I just love doing that except it makes a huge mess. So that's a bit about my future me jobs. I am very crafty. I make a lot of things. Over here you can just see this mask I made, um, throw blankets, this briefcase, 
thing I made for Jess and she goes to work, I guess. Um, I made this really, really cute alarm clock. And I just don't think there's a whole lot of stuff I made in this room, but there are in the other rooms way more things. I think especially in Joss and Jenny's room, you kind of had to customize it to give it the beachy look for Joss. And yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I'm just going to talk a little bit more about what you'll see on this channel, which is stop motions, live videos, kind of like this one. Um, DIYs, maybe a few unboxing videos, cleaning up videos. My dollhouse gets very messy. I just clean it. That's how this room's all neat. Um, I have a bunch of lights, like three lights in the room beside this, just so it would be okay lighting. I know it's not the best of lighting. My photos got way better because of the flash thing. It's kind of a flash that my camera has, and I have a tripod. It doesn't shake. I used to use my brother's, but now I use my own because my brother used his for his own videos, but he used to use his for stop motions, but now I have my own tripod, and I love it, and I have my own camera, and lights, and all those things. Yeah, I hope you liked this video, and now you know a bit about me. I think throughout my YouTube videos, you'll learn a lot more about my dolls. There will be an All My Dolls video, maybe in a few videos next, so I'm just going to try to pre-film a bunch of videos and edit them with my brother because he edits my videos for me with me and yeah you'll see a few stop motions coming up too because i'm planning one in my head and writing the script and yeah i will have some videos coming up soon and hope you enjoy see ya bye